Yo, what's going on guys, it's Houston Sports Talk, back in the video today, and today we're going to be talking about a potential signing for the New Orleans Saints, as the New Orleans Saints today are hosting running back Kareem Hunt for a visit tonight. They are also hosting linebacker Anthony Barr, former Minnesota Viking, but we're going to be talking about Kareem Hunt potentially signing with the New Orleans Saints. It's just a, a couple days ago, Alvin Kamara uh, best running back on the Saints was suspended for three games. And, I mean, it's not like, I mean, honestly, they can be without Kamara for the, you know, first three games, and they still have a great, you know, they have they have great running backs. They have, Jan, they have Jamal Williams, who had the most rushing touchdowns in the NFL last year and signed with the Saints on a three-year, $12 million deal. And that was probably the Saints' best addition besides, I mean, is either him or Derek Carr. I think Jamal Williams was the best addition for the Saints this offseason. Um, he had 17 rushing touchdowns with 1,060 rushing yards. Most rushing touchdowns in the NFL last year. It was amazing for the for the Lions. Then they drafted Keandre Miller from TCU in the third round. I think he's going to be a stud as well. And they also have Alvin Kamara. Like I said, he's only missing the first three games. It's not like he's missing a handful of the season, like six to eight games, ten games. He's only missing the first three games of the season. I mean, three games can be, you know, it's three three games is, you know, three games. But at the same time, you have guys that can step up for you while Kamara is gone, like Jamal Williams and Keandre Miller. So, I mean, I just feel like this could be, a this this is I I just feel like Kamara's suspension is not that hurting to the Saints just because they have two really good running backs besides Kamara, but imagine if they sign Kareem Hunt, and once Kamara comes back from once Kamara comes back from suspension, you have a running back core of Alvin Kamara, Jamal Williams, and Kareem Hunt, and then alongside those three guys, you have potentially Keandre Miller, third round pick. In, in this year's draft those are your four running backs honestly i'm gonna go ahead and say it if the saints sign kareem hunt if the visit goes well and the saints pick up kareem hunt uh, who played with the browns this season and you pair him with with jamal williams and once alvin Kamara comes back after suspension in week four and third round pick andrea miller those four guys right there the saints have the best running back crew in the nfl you, those are your four running backs right there. I, I think if the Saints are able to, you know, if they have a good visit with, with Hunt and they sign him, oh, man, the running game for the Saints will be nasty. Between Kareem Hunt, you know, he's a guy who's a great rusher but is a great receiving back as well. And then Jamal Williams, a great rushing back. And then same thing for Kamara. And then Keandre Miller, stud, great rusher, great receiver as well. I just think this this running this running back crew for the Saints, if they pick up Kareem Hunt after week three, once week four, and once Kamara comes back, it would be dangerous for the NFL for other defenses to face Hunt, Williams, and Kamara. Um, I really do feel like Kareem Hunt would be a good addition for the New Orleans Saints. We'll see how the workout works for them. Uh, Kareem Hunt this season had 35 receptions with one receiving touchdown and 210 receiving yards. He had 123 rushes, 123 rushing attempts with three rushing touchdowns and 470 rushing yards. Uh, as his his stats were a little down this year, but at the same time, Nick Chubb was you know having a way better you know way better year than he's than he's had in the past. I mean, Nick Chubb has been always been great for the for the Browns, but I feel like Nick Chubb last year had his best year of his career. So. Kareem Kareem Hunt started to get a little bit of less carries this season and also missed a couple games this season as well. I think he only played like 15 games for the Browns this year. Uh, he only played like 14 or 15 games. So he did miss like two or three games for the Browns this year. So um, that, that also affected it as well uh, with his stats going down. But we'll see how the visit works out for the two sides today between the Saints and Hunt. But if the, if the Saints would pick Kareem Hunt up and sign him and add him in with Kamara... You know, once he comes back in week four after the three week suspension, and Jamal Williams, who had a thousand sixty rushing yards last season with seventeen rushing touchdowns, which was the most in the NFL last season, and third round draft pick Keandre Miller from TCU, man, this Saints running game would be nasty. 
using our thoughts on the potential signing. That's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed and peace out. Let me know your thoughts.